UK, Veolia and its partner Peterson are providing new circular economy solutions to the oil and gas industry. The new decommissioning site at Great Yarmouth will give a second life to the materials from two North Sea oil platforms. V as in Veolia. Located in Aubervilliers to the north of Paris, the new head office brings together 2,000 employees in a maison commune at the cutting edge of sustainable innovation. Distribute quality drinking water to 350,000 people of the remote region of Greater Matalay. This is the challenge of the contract awarded by the Sri Lankan National Water Supply and Drainage Board. The Métropole Européenne de Lille has selected Veolia and its partner EDEX to recover its household waste for urban heating. 40% of the energy produced will directly supply the urban heating networks in Roubaix and Lille. Veolia is developing a series of experiments with Carbon Clean Solutions Limited, a startup specialized in low-cost carbon capture technology. The goal is the large-scale decarbonization of industrial processes to help combat climate change. Veolia has been selected to collect and recycle waste for one million residents in South London. With this new contract, the group now manages the waste of three million people in London. In China, Veolia has been awarded three major contracts by industrial companies who are counting on the group to optimize their energy performance and thus enable them to comply with the country's new environmental regulations. In Mexico City, Veolia will build and operate one of the world's largest waste-to-energy plants and the first in Latin America. Every year, the plant will transform 1.6 million tons of waste into green energy, which will be used to directly supply the city's metro network. In Brussels, Veolia has been chosen to manage and renovate the heat production plant at the Université Catholique de Louvain. The group will also operate the associated heating network, which supplies all university buildings and the Saint-Luc University Clinic, the city's largest hospital. Veolia acquired Uke, a specialist in sorting and recycling waste in Hungary. Through five sites throughout the country, Uke transforms 118,700 tons of waste each year into new raw materials. Hurricane Irma devastated the islands of St. Martin and St. Bart's. In the face of this emergency, the teams from Veolia and the Veolia Foundation worked relentlessly to restore the production and distribution of drinking water. A mobile seawater desalination unit was sent by plane. Veolia is a founder partner of AirLab, the first air quality innovation accelerator. As part of this effort, the group is developing alongside ECAD an innovative project to control indoor air quality in office buildings. The oil and gas producer Antero Resources has entrusted Veolia with the treatment of sludge from water recycling processes at its Clearwater site in the U.S. This sludge contains low-level naturally radioactive waste generated by industrial production processes. A multitude of wastewater contracts in France, Veolia, the Greater Paris Sanitation Authority, the Intermunicipal Association for Water Management, the Le Mans Métropole, and the Métropole Européenne de Lille are inventing the wastewater treatment plant of the future. For the first time in Japan, the Hamamatsu Local Authority has entrusted the long-term concession of its wastewater systems to a private operator. In Australia, Veolia will build and operate a water treatment plant for the Springvale Mine and the Mount Piper Power Station, which supplies 15% of the electricity used in New South Wales.